Stopping Alzheimer's disease before it's too late. More than 6 million Americans are living with Alzheimer's. There is no cure yet, but a drug recently approved by the FDA is giving some patients hope for a better future. That's a grandson. 77 year old Joan Murtaugh is sifting mm -hmm. through a lifetime of memories. We've got grandchildren that we really enjoy. But a few years ago, Joan and her husband Larry felt something was off. I did see Joan go through a decline. Joan was diagnosed with early stage Alzheimer's disease. There was nothing doctors could do, but now a recently FDA approved drug may help slow the progression. This is the first one uh, that received a full approval. The medication Lakembi reduces deposits in the brain linked to Alzheimer's disease. If somehow you interrupt this cascade of amyloid buildup in the brain, you may be able to slow down this progression. Early stage Alzheimer patients who received the medication had a 27% reduction of amyloid beta plaque and a slower rate of cognitive decline. Doctors also saw a decrease in another harmful brain protein called tau tangles. It's not just removing the plaque, amyloid. We were able to show all these changes in these biomarkers of disease. Joan has been on the medication for three years. I think she's clearer, she's sharper. She'll remember something from that happened yesterday or the day before. I'm thinking, something's working here. When I think about it, I can still drive a car. I mean, I can go back and forth and do the things I always did. Joan and Larry hope it will continue to work and they'll continue to create many more memories together. By the way, Dr. Tusi believes this is just the beginning. Clinical trials are already underway using Lakembi in people who are at high risk for Alzheimer's but are not showing any signs of cognitive decline. However, it's not without risks. In its approval, the FDA included its strongest warning label about side effects, noting that Lakembi can lead to bleeding and also brain swelling.